I like today folks, my name is DCM and welcome to my Japan vlog. This is part one of many to come, I'm actually not sure how much there's going to be, maybe two or three, I'm not really sure. But yeah, so this is the first part, enjoy it, um, it's just a random like collection of footage that I got from my first couple of days there. Um, unfortunately I wasn't really allowed to film in a lot of places and I actually got kind of ill in uh, London and Beijing airport just because all the waiting around and stuff. But yeah, I'm going to put all them descriptions into the vlog anyway, so you know for yourself which part we're at in the vlog. Which is pretty cool, keep you up to date and in line with the vlog so you kind of know where I am at the time. But yeah, so, enjoy it! Um, I enjoyed it, obviously, because it was bloody amazing, I'm like, Japan was just the best experience of my life so far. Um, not to mention, I actually, we got engaged, me and my, well, fiance, we got engaged over there, so it was brilliant. <laughs> Um, that'll probably be in part two. This isn't in this part, unfortunately. Oh dear. And I didn't actually record that because, um, well, I kind of forgot. But hey, <laughs> it's the thought that counts, right? <laughs> anyway, enjoy the vlog! Having fun? Yes, totally. London is so fun! Woo! So yeah, here we are. Uh, Heathrow Airport, waiting to check in. Uh, I'm on the Hazy Hog. Yeah, cider, cider. I am so bored. We are so bored. And also, I feel really ill. So hopefully, that goes away pretty soon. And there's that. Hey. Yeah, she's like totally more energized than I am. So yeah, hopefully next time I am filming, it'll probably be at the airplane or maybe in China. Probably China or the airplane. Who knows? I don't know. Look at this. Do not eat the stone. Means somebody wants eh, these stones. Beautiful. Just beautiful. Look at this cool little thing. This is in the Beijing airport. Since we've got 16 hours here, but look at this vending machine. Look, look at that Red Bull. It's Red Bull but China. Red Bull Extra. I'm guessing this is Fanta and Cola and Sprite. But Angry Birds. What? Is that beer? Um, KFC Beijing. Look at this. Is this different? I don't know. I don't normally order this from uh, from KFC, but the juice is in a little bag. So this is the juice you get. Yeah. Yeah. Look at that bad boy. I think it's called Five Alive Five Stars. I can't really remember to be honest. And also, I don't remember seeing any gravy, which is pretty not good for me because I'm a gravy guy. Okay, so here is the missing item. It's missing. It's chicken nuggets. Chicken nuggets in KFC. What? It, it tastes good though. Okay, so these things are like little bits of chicken, but they are like super, super spicy. Like, wow. Oh, a flavor though. Amazing. Oh, wow. Yeah. What is that? Amazing. Awesome. Do we get this in the UK? I don't think so. been about 15 hours in Beijing just um, just waiting it's been eventful kind of not really been good though uh, so I try not to talk too loudly because there's people sleeping all around me um, I was one of them I slept for a good while too but yeah I'll always show you my view what's going on oh look Steph's joining me now Boom. yay Steph's back Finally! <laughs> <laughs> 
Back streets of uh, Tokyo at about 20 past 8 in the morning. As you can see, it's actually quite quiet. Um, not really much going on, mainly because it's so early, but it's so Pokemon. peaceful. And Seth's playing Pokemon. Of course. Of course. It's just so bizarre. It's eerie. Um, I mean, you just got kind of people going to the work, really. I mean, you've got to imagine this is just a normal day for them. Then again, it is Sunday, so I don't know if everybody works on a Sunday. I think they do. I think it's mainly Wednesdays they take a day off, I've heard. Um, oh, I've got a dog. I've got a dog. So, yeah. Let's go. Cool. Oh, there's a, a vending machine. These things are everywhere. And they're all, they're all different. Um, like these ones here, they're actually hot. So you got, you know, you got your cold water and whatever, and then like these ones and these fire ones, they actually come out served hot, which is ace because it's coffee. And who doesn't love coffee first thing in the morning? And now back to the dog. Cool. Look at this pretty little kind of street we got going on here. Also, one thing, um, the streets are very clean, and there's like no bins at all, because the policy here is not to litter. They don't have bins because bins cause litter. Um, you use, so if you've got rubbish, you just take it home with you, or find a shop, that's or got a bin. find a shop that's got a bin, which actually makes sense. And it is honestly one of the cleanest places I've ever seen in my life. Braille. Yeah, and there's braille everywhere, like. Everywhere, everything has braille for blind people, which is genius because that's one thing you actually don't really see a lot in Britain these days is braille for blind people. Consider oh look, there's another vending machine. See, told you, everywhere. And a mailbox, wow. Another thing, road crossings are automatic. You don't press a button unless it's night time. You just stand and wait. It's motion censored. And then this thing here gives you like a little countdown timer sometimes depends not all of them do it okay so we're deciding to screw the rules and probably get arrested or hit by a car because <laughs> mad person step here is just insane so let's uh, travel on upwards I can't remember if I already mentioned but this one we're actually on our way to Akihabara which is the anime a video game central an electric like the electric streets and city of Tokyo. Um, there's actually oh god, I just fell off a step. The curb. Ah, Japan is so dangerous. <laughs> um, yeah. Anyway, there should be a park up here, which I'm gonna cut to in a minute. There you go. More vending machines. This one has Monster. It has green tea. Is there green tea up there? Yeah, green tea. Yeah, it actually comes out as green tea, like in a bowl. And there's tons of coffee. That's all coffee. That bottom two rows. Which is crazy and two just another whole vending machine. Hot green tea. Yeah, hot green tea. Huh. What's that? Cool. Cool. Okay, so here we have Pepsi Refresh Shot. I've never heard of it, but I'm gonna try it because YOLO. Uh, that's it. These things are so handy. I don't even know. Okay, so I got um, Pepsi refresh shot. Strong cola. Jeez. That smells like Pepsi. <laughs> it's just Pepsi. <laughs> it's just really strong Pepsi, like. 
yeah, it just tastes like really, really strong pepsi. That's all. Which is really weird. Maybe it's got caffeine in it, I don't know. But it is just legit, like, really, really strong flavor pepsi. On the way to the park, and there's another shrine temple that a lot of people actually pray to quite a lot and worship. They pay money to their, uh, to their, I don't know, god or sometimes it's not even a god or anything, it's just something that they believe in that they pay money to, which is, I mean, uh, it's the way they do things over here, so it's pretty cool. But you find them quite a lot. Um, they're really common. There's tons of them that mean different things. So we was meant to be on our way to uh, that park, but we kind of bypassed it and went to this coffee shop. And um, this coffee looks amazing. So it's got tea. It's just busy with that camera. But you can actually hear the music. Hear it? Yeah. It's just, I'm trying to talk quietly, so I'm not being rude, but it's just delicious. Like, the ring here is so cool. So nice. She's so engrossed in the camera. Sunday they closed the road because it's so busy here and it's just incredible. It is literally just a heaving of people. It's nuts. And they got no, no dangers, no cars are dangers. Unless somebody wants to go rogue, I suppose. There's only glimpses, not gonna lie. But holy crap, that was a really hot building. It was like, it was insane. It was insane, it was insanely hot. So, down some more busy streets we go and see what else lies ahead for us. Okay, this is the same building. Um, you know if you hear me, it's all like arcades. People are so good at games. Cosplay slash taxi shop. Seth. Oh man, the Markiplier. Crazy. Kinky. Okay, Temptation is super real to buy this Goku costume. Or Piccolo. Or Vegeta, or Frieza. Oh my god. My dreams could come true. Oh, it could be Pen Pen Apple Apple Pen Man. Chris Redfield from uh, uh, Resident Evil. Totally did a playthrough in that and I forgot the name. Ah! Uh, Mario. Mario. This is amazing. What else is in here? Oh. Um. Okay, that's kind of perverted, but never mind. Oh, look. You could be. Gun master, sword master. Okay, we're in a retro game shop and it is just amazing. It's actually the best thing ever. There's so much stuff. It's 
so cool. Look, all the Nintendo 64 games. Oh. Majora's Mask! In Japanese. Majora's Elden in Japanese. Pokemon! Pokemon! More Pokemon! For some reason there's Super Mario World that is playing Zelda music. Which is kind of confusing me now. All the Game Boy games, the Nintendo systems, handhelds, absolutely everything possible. Okay, let's uh, get out of here. <laughs> I'll take the bargain buckets. Ten games for three pounds. Well, three, three hundred yen. Three hundred yen, which is like three pounds. We've got like um, a One Piece game. CD, that's a, that's, a, that's a PlayStation game. And, uh, I love Japan. I love Japan. <laughs> okay, Seth, what did we just buy? Uh, takoyaki. And the juice I thought was cool out. Look at the fucking size of it. I thought it was cool, there's two blue. shots. I wanted to try it because it's blue. It's definitely not cool there. No, it's like bubblegum or something. Yeah, it's bubblegum <laughs> of some sort. This is this. Okay, or let's... Grape. Is this octopus? Yeah, octopus balls, fried. <laughs> I'm very nervous, but okay, let's try that. <laughs> okay, that's the, what is it called again? Takoyaki. Takoyaki balls. Um, looks awesome. You got it? Yeah. I think you meant to eat a whole. Uh, it's too big for my mouth. What's in there? <laughs> really? Octopus. What's it taste like? It tastes good? It's alright. Oh, uh, you do sound so keen. It's the butter. Okay. I'm not a big fan of the butter. Any good? Mm. So here's the actual juice I've been drinking. What fucking green it is! Why is that? It's like pure sugar. I don't know what it is. It's amazing though, I know that. Okay, so um, ordered McDonald's Japanese breakfast called the Mega Muffin, which I don't think we get in Britain at all. Typical hash brown and a cola. So I've got uh, bacon and egg cheese McGriddles. They also do um, chicken chicken muffins, where instead of the bun, it's just full of chicken, which is crazy. So anyway, I'm gonna open this bad boy up and let's we'll see what we've got. Oh, this, is, this looks amazing. It's got bacon, egg, uh, patty, cheese, two patties, more bacon. It just looks incredible. This looks absolutely delicious. Get in my belly. Oh, and there's sesame. It looks so dinky and small. It's really mine. M on top. Amazing. I think we got that everywhere. I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to go munch into this. Though. Okay, so we just discovered in the Steph's thing, there's actually the maple syrup. The, the buns are filled with maple syrup. Yeah. Oh. That's amazing. So it's like maple pancakes with egg, cheese, and bacon. I am so jealous. I want one now. Thanks for watching this part of the Japan vlog. More will come when they're ready, and they'll be up when they're ready. <laughs> What else can I say? I'm going to focus on these vlogs more than gameplay at the moment because these are taking a lot of time to do because I've got like 340 videos to go through to like cramp into all these like small little videos for you guys. So yeah, I'm going to power through them and then I'll go back to new games or indie games or horror games. What do you want? I don't know. Suggest stuff. I'm an open book or am I an open game? Ooh, spooky. No idea what that was about. But anyway, don't forget to leave a like today if you enjoyed the video and don't forget to subscribe to become part of the Fit Like family as I catch up on more content over at the channel. And as I say at the end of the other video, I shall see you guys in the next video.
Catch you later, guys. Drop the beast.